For thousands of years, practitioners have inserted needles into specific points on the body, believing they could redirect a life force called QI. The idea sounds like something out of a fantasy novel. But here's the million-dollar question. Does it actually work? And if so, how can a belief in ancient energy pathways possibly line up with modern medicine? The truth is it doesn't. Modern science doesn't recognize Kui or meridians. But that doesn't mean the practice is useless. Instead, what scientists have discovered is a powerful physiological mechanism behind the ancient art. When a needle is inserted, it doesn't redirect energy. It stimulates your nervous system. Many traditional acupuncture points are located right where nerves, blood vessels, and connective tissues are most concentrated. The tiny pinprick sends a signal through those nerves to your brain. In response, your brain releases a cascade of natural painkillers and feel-good chemicals, like endorphins. This natural pain relief is a huge reason why acupuncture is so effective for chronic pain. It's a form of what scientists call neuromodulation, a way of talking to your brain to change its behavior. So, does it work? The data says yes, especially for things like chronic back pain, headaches, and migraines. While the placebo effect definitely plays a role, studies show acupuncture provides measurable benefits beyond simply believing it will. It's not magic. It's not even a mystery. It's a prime example of how an ancient ritual, based on one set of beliefs, can produce a very real, very measurable physical effect that modern science can now explain.